school? Anna need a Big Mac responds to the backlash of her calling Roly a monkey. Yes. What's that, fat what? ass? Monkey and fat back and EBT talking a shit hoodie. Let's talk about it. Child, so on the Baddies East reunion trailer, Anna called Rolly a fat monkey. Yeah. Trust that fat what? monkey back. Trust that fat what? Monkey okay, and of course she faced a lot of backlash, honey. So she posts this. I'm gonna say this one time and one time only. Only y'all know I'm not a nor colorist. Y'all know she built like a gorilla. All my best friends besides one are dark skin slash brown skin. My family full of dark skins, etc. I love them down. Y'all can never make me look otherwise. Oh. Well, let's see if these comments are feeling what she had to say, baby. Colorists say the same thing do. I can say the N word because all my friends is black. It went from worse to worser. So you think you not a colorist because some of your family dark skin? <laughs> Ooh, one says something about Roly. Plus, Roly definitely made fun of Hispanics. That is true, because she always be making fun of Biggie's accent all the time. Mm hmm She'd be like, -r 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 -r. It's like, girl, sit your big ass down. But now let's get into this sneak peek of the Baddies East reunion, honey. You got Scar Credit and Shamu talking about what they gonna do, and they gonna have each other's back. Let's watch. All this time, how you feel to be back? I'm a little nervous. Why? Because I'm about to be crazy. Who y'all get down tonight, because... I got some surprise, you know, people I'm gonna get that nobody know about. And then, you know, the usual bitches talking shit, you know. You know, the whole house B gang gang. They got on live, said they was gonna judge me. Let's see it. The crazy thing, I, that's what the f is not gonna happen. You already know that. I'm going out with a bang, a big one. Oh, bitch, I'm going in with a bang. Anybody being shady, I got you. Anybody with the little uh uh's, I got you. Well, girl, it looked like your body got banged up, and that's why you have to go MIA for a few weeks. Who goes to a reunion where you fight two weeks after you got surgery? Bitch, that's stupid. And I don't know why Zeus allowed you to do that. But I guess you signed your life away, honey. Zeus probably said, Scarface, you are making a willing decision to put your body at risk. As Zeus is not liable for any fraudulent charges. But then Roly talking about, oh, I'm gonna have your back, honey, and nobody gonna do nothing to you. But the people be saying that you totally abandoned her, honey. And it might have to do with the fact that Scarface ran up on Natalie. Mm -hmm. And if you notice, Scarface did allude to the fact that there's gonna be some surprises that she's gonna pull. Let's replay that. I got some surprise, you know, people I'm gonna get that nobody know about. And mm, see, and Natalie was one of them surprises, honey. And that's probably why Roly switched up on her. Now let's get to the desperate need to talk about Zeus all the time to get her streams up, but it ain't even working. Stunner Girl did a cryptic tweet talking about how one of the baddie hoes showed up to a booking and only got paid $1,500 and the booking was empty, honey. Who you think she talking about? Child, I think she talking about Anna Mac, baby. But you be the judge. Imagine getting booked for $1,500 and nobody shows up. Crowd on empty. That's a double dookie. Not a double dookie. You bitches know what I'm about and don't be ready for me. So why do y'all bother me then? Cracking the fuck up. I suggest you shut your mouth and fuck bitch your speed. Oh, she definitely talking about Anna. Crowd on empty. Might as well stay home and let that promoter save his 1500 Ugh, girl, I don't know. I'm just, I'm over Stunner Girl. And that's kind of why I didn't do a video about Stunner Girl pulling up to the Zeus Network headquarters. Because I'm just like, that is so stupid and thirsty. Like, what? And then you got your whole camera crew got matching outfits as your man. This is all fucking a publicity stunt. That is so whack. And I'm surprised they let you in the building, bitch. If this was my shit and you aired me the out, like you aired them out, bitch, you wouldn't even be able to get in the mother parking garage in my shit. Hell the no. But what do y'all think? Do you think Stunner Girl is standing on business? You better not play with her and doop de doop de doop a woop woop woop. Or do you think she's just a whack ass bitch that ain't got nothing better to do? Comment down below.